Welcome to the latest Browsio demo for version 3. Today is March 20th, 2017, and I hope you're well. Let's just jump straight into it. So for those of you that don't know, Browsio is the world's first and only 100% custom proprietary automation browser, enabling you to automate any online task, leaving you more time for your actual SEO and social media marketing. So think of Browsio as your um, web hub. So not only does it handle all of your social media account management, it takes care of all your content discovery as well, helping you pinpoint the most viral and popular content across the web, um, while making it so easy and fast to redistribute that across unlimited personas. Browsio is a content marketer's dream. It's Content Curation 3.0. Now, you can do this for as many social media accounts and personas as you want. Yes, that means an unlimited amount of Facebook accounts. You can connect an unlimited amount of Google Plus accounts, connect an unlimited amount of YouTube, Twitter, and so on and so forth. Any account will connect and work with Browsio. As I said, it's a custom browser. There are absolutely no limitations or restrictions. So let's just jump straight into that. This is Browsio. On the side, on the left-hand side, we've got the projects. Um, you have the ability to create folders and projects and, and, and section them out as you like. I'm just going to jump straight into the demo folder that I have over here that I use. Um, we're going to open up some profiles. And what's going to happen here is each project that I'm opening up is opening up on a totally separate um, IP, totally separate proxy, has its own set of um, unique cookies, cache, and so on and so forth, all connected to this persona. Um, so you've got your anonymity settings I've got here who are opened up. I mean, you know, you can use any site that you want. Um, it just happens to be who are that a lot of people use. Um, so we can change, for example, I think the time <coughs> has gone back with daylight savings since the last time we were here. So if I apply that, we can get 100% anonymity. <coughs> And there you have it. Okay, so we can save that session and come back and you'll have the exact same settings there. Um, this is Firefox. We also have Chrome. Um, all of the settings up here within the browser um, allow you to share straight from the browser. You're logged in to whoever it is you're going to be logged in. Save your sites, form filler, um, social stats, um, browser settings allowing you to give you absolute customizations of your flash plugins webgl javascript java webrtc whether or not you want to allow the tracking sync your time full control over the languages browser languages whether you want to show them the size of the fonts whether to hide the fonts um and you know absolute full control over everything even user agents allowing you to um, spoof the user agent allowing you to use any user agent that you want um so you know everything from your basic um, footprints and and anonymity like WebRTC, all the way through to the most severe canvas fingerprinting are all taken care of within Browsio. So you can mix and match each session as you like. Um, there are also, for each browser setting, you have your bookmarks and you also have your automation settings that are available um, for each persona over here as well, not just um, multi-threaded. We'll show later on. Okay, so that's Firefox. Then you have Chrome, which is exactly the same, only in Chrome. Then the Prospector. I mean, there are a few settings different, um, but it's basically the ability to switch and use the two different um, browsers with this custom system. The Prospector, this is where it all starts coming in, where you're looking for places to prospect for backlinks and places that you want to go have jump into conversations. So you have, um, you can, let's say you want to go look for something in the diet niche and this connects you directly to comment love. So it'll pull back the results. And if you want to look for forums in the diet niche, you know, you've got all these predefined footprints over here, which you will just, um, just allows you to go out and find those conversations. Um, then you've got guest post blogs, link roundups. Um, you've got the custom setting over here, which is just literally um, Google. So that's going to be just the Google results. And you may have noticed all of these social um, social integration we've got here. We've got social integration um, within the entire site. That's also within um, Browsio over here. So we can have we have the social stats here, which gives you all of the social sharing sites. It can also go ahead and crawl all of the links on the page and give you the social stats for all of the links on the page, which can come in quite handy 
um, for your own websites and sites that you are prospecting from. Um, so back into the prospector. We changed over, didn't we? So we were over there. Um, guest posts, blogs, link roundups, as I said, custom, and you can drill down and find the most popular content here from Facebook all the way to the likes, comments, what's got the most comments, plus ones, pins, and so on and so forth. Then we have the RSS feeds. This is where the RSS, um, your content gets fed into Browsio as well, so you can go and get any RSS feed that you want and feed that into Browsio, allowing you to then curate that out to Publish Hub, send that out to um, different social sites that you um, uh, you know that you want to post to by right clicking and you know Facebook ordering by the most popular finding the most popular content of course we always want to share the most popular content and then going ahead and curating so we if we press curate here it will go ahead and send that into our publish hub which is the next module on and you can then go ahead and just literally click here and push that there and that will bring back all of your sites that you can post to just tick the one you want to post out to and this is a WYSIWYG custom WYSIWYG editor that allows you full control over the time down to the second and including categories and tags and the images featured image and excerpts exactly all of the content that you would need if as if you were posting from your WordPress dashboard and then it's got all the other features as well um, spin text enabled so you can spin and add as many images and posts and variations and videos and so on and so forth as you like that's where all this comes in and there's all training within the members area for that um, the feed masher very simple it's just an online web place for you to drop your links in here I'll pull back you can edit them um, where what you where you basically you've got your links here and it will just add and create an RSS feed for you to go and drop wherever you want these are just YouTube URLs and then it gives you down here the XML and the HTML to go and drop those for syndication or um, just you know to get backlinks indexed whatever it might be um, FB Conversio in itself again each one of these modules has got in-depth training so I'm just really glazing over it um, FB Conversio um, it just helps you within literally minutes drill down for any niche the most popular pages most popular groups and then when you've got those pages it will find the most popular page and then when you're in that page it will then drill down to the most popular post and video and then drill down by the most popular shared and liked and commented and total control so within minutes no matter what niche you're in you're going to find the best content to go out and share SEO module is just um, let your imagination run wild, drop in any links that you want to any profiles that are already logged in or not logged in and use it to crowd search to go ahead and search through um, Bing, Google and create a little bit of buzz, um, YouTube views, commenting, um, live if you're doing Google um, YouTube live streaming you can go ahead and open up the streams in each one of these modules um, for example like this we can go ahead and open up the stream here in Facebook I mean in Firefox using this proxy that pro profile persona and um, then you've got this other one here and you can just open it up with Chrome and Firefox and keep everything all mixed up. So this is in this is in Chrome. So we'll close that down. And then the last one, which is the automation module, which allows you to literally automate an unlimited amount of tasks here. Let's go into that one. This is the main one that I use. And so, for example, you can go ahead and this is the automation club. You have to be part of that. That's a monthly which automates pretty much everything and we're adding some awesome things we've got an indexer coming in very soon and then we have this which everyone gets basic social networks to allow you to automate so I'm gonna just basically do a very basic Google followed by keyword and you want to come in here and I'm just gonna demo it just finish off with this show you how this will work it'll go ahead and grab all these wait let's just use four one two three four and close that down there apply and we're gonna use um, uh, body building muscle um, fitness diet weight loss and that's it and we're gonna say one for each one so one 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 each profile is gonna go to a different keyword do a search and then follow and I can you know loop it here as many times as I want and I can also have the windows load and launch with with different timings so that if I don't want them to all load load at the same time I can have them load between one and three seconds apart so here we'll just use that for effect we'll do between we'll do between one 
I just will do between two and three seconds apart. Okay, and that's great for, for if you just want to get a, a bunch of uh, quick YouTube views and you don't want them to all appear at the same time. So as you can see, that's between two and three seconds, almost one after another. And we're already logged into Facebook. We're logged into all the sites, as you saw before. Um, you know, we save the cookies and your cash and they're sealed in this browse environment so that when you come back, just like you're on your computer when you're um, uh, traveling from one state to another, or one country to another, you come back to your computer and you're still logged in because those sites have recognized your computer. So this is like your own separate computer. So as you can see, it's automated it, it's gone out and it's followed and it's following and it's basically gone and done that. Everything's logged in as it should be. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that demo. I hope you understand. You've got a very broad understanding of what Browsio can do. And please um, contact me via the site or in the comments below. PM me. Um, let me know what you think. If you've got any questions, um, talk, to you, talk to you soon.